they nerfed his ass. Hello from Japan. I won this guy in a crane game, believe it or not. Cost me like $30, but worth it in my opinion. Ass or no ass? This guy has completely decimated fandom. Miguel O'Hara, aka Spider-Man 2099, aka hot angsty vampire dilf Spider-Man with a shoulder to waist ratio that could put a Dorito to shame. Enough cake to cater a quinceanera, enough booba to put Victoria's Secret out of business, and enough trauma and emotional turmoil to fill the hurt no comfort tag on AO3 easy peasy. He's raw, he's unrestrained when he loses his cool, he's desperate to hold on to any semblance of control after all he's been through, and he actually has some pretty funny moments sprinkled throughout the movie. He completely steals the show, even though he only has like 10 minutes of screen time. So, an antagonist in a very tight suit who's complex and angry, has a tortured past, has been through hell and back, and is determined to do things his way, and has a very nice voice, thank you Oscar Isaac, and nice hair, and a nice bod, and fangs. <laughs> Jude, it's like he was made to be fandom catnip. Are you kidding me? Even before seeing the movie, just minding my business online, do you know how many times I've been flashed by Miguel O'Hara's <laughs> on my screen? How many times this man's ass has graced my For You page and timeline with zero warning? Thank you, by the way, to all the people I follow for being horny on main. Appreciate y'all. And the creators apparently toned him down. We're getting the nerfed version of his design. Holy sh**. Could you imagine the damage he'd do with his original model? The carnage that would ensue? So with everyone getting jump scared left and right by Spider Daddy, I thought it'd be funny to showcase just how down watch. bad the internet is for this guy. Cause it's bad, bad. Like parched in the desert for over 48 hours, bad. So without further ado, let's go across the Spider-Verse. Oh my God, he's trending. Oh good Lord. <laughs> Damn, Miguel, that booty though. Holy f I just love looking at him. <laughs> Daddy railing spider daddy. Oh, you look so handsome. Um, I'd ship it. Did they build the baby together? Was it a labor of love? Oh, mm. a little scrongly. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This is the skin of a killer vile. <laughs> I am intrigued. Listen, I'm 100% on board for Mary Jane and Peter, but I can appreciate some good art. Oh my god, and the. That is such a cool effect, whoa! Look at the bobas on that one. A Lila cosplay would be really fun to do. I already have the pieces for it, the hard eye glasses and the fur coat. Does that mean I get a Miguel of my own? Oh my God, he's captured so well here. <laughs> the Spanish. <laughs> do you think Spider-Cat is his emotional support? <laughs> Miguel, I'm sorry, you're Spider-Man. You could either be hot or happy. You can't have both for long. Is that how their baby Lego was conceived? I'm sorry. Please do not be sorry for this. The way that Miguel O'Hara was on all fours flopping around and flinging himself through glass windows, the whole movie is wild. See, in this situation, we are all Miguel chasing after Miles, who in this case would be all of the sexy Miguel content. And we are going full feral for it. You guys gotta stop making stuff for this ship. I'm getting more and more invested. That's gonna be my new phone wallpaper. <laughs> Dad Miguel, Dad Miguel. Dad Miguel. I have a suggestion, Miguel, but with pretty pink cat ears. Thank you. Maybe if you stop chasing down 15 year olds and play Stardew Valley instead, you'd calm down. <laughs> I just scroll and I see. Sorry, it was briefly hypnotized. <gasps> oh my god, he looks so good. He looks so good. Like with any character, the talents and things always add that extra oomph, you know? Oh, the things I do to this man and let him do to me. <laughs> at an inn in Japan, I cannot scream. At an inn in Japan, I cannot scream. At an inn in Japan, I cannot scream. Sir, those look awfully heavy. I can hold those for you if you'd like. POV, you disrupted a canon event. Oh no, I sure hope that Miguel O'Hara doesn't just break through a window and chase me. What would I do? <laughs> Zoom Zoom Miguel! Super cute, they captured your eyes so perfectly, I ordered 5,000! What? <laughs> Lila, I will happily take your entire stock. And here comes your two favorite dilfs. All of this Miguel O'Hara content, same! What you doing out here with all this ass? Double cheeked up on a Thursday afternoon, hella ass, the sun is still out. <laughs> oh my god, I can't do this. Jump scared by his ass. Can't keep getting away with this. Come on. I don't know if you can see, but I have goosebumps. I am. I'm turning. I feel like I'm. Act I'm actually gonna cry. It's just too much. Leave me alone. I'm afraid I can't do that, sir. Where do I sign up to be the spider? <laughs> He's watching Bluey with Mayday. That's so cute. Kiss me. I'm Irish. 
You know for a fact that his Catholic guilt must be out of control, though. Spider-Verse artists were creating this scene. <laughs> it's so funny. I've already seen a couple posts being like, he's not a vampire. Don't call him a vampire. Like, we know he's not. But if you give fans enough pieces, they're gonna put them together. Incredibly attractive with fangs and paralyzing venom. He's already more of a vampire than Edward Cullen. They talk mad shit. Yeah. Someone's gonna ask me, what's your favorite part of this whole Miguel O'Hara craze? Is it his <laughs> his <laughs> I'm gonna say no, it's him and Lego Spider-Man. <laughs> This is my favorite thing, like superheroes wearing jeans or sweatpants over their suits. Mask on or off, I don't care. Spider fangs! Who from what earth did you have a tumble with, my dear? No, this is perfect though, because according to the Spider-Verse, there could very well be a universe where I'm Spider-Man and I could have a chance with Miguel. I am not religious, but... How much do I have to pay you to erase that last little bit? For science, of course. I didn't think I'd come out of this movie wanting to see more of these two together. Why do you have a pocket on your suit? Lego, ah, he pops out. <laughs> Neuron activation. <laughs> oh, Miguel being a girl dad. That is so sweet. Do you feel bonita? I do feel bonita. I love all versions of Miguel and this one is really, really sweet. <laughs> It is a good day to be a Spider-Man fan. Well, what? I can't show that. <laughs> the reality is that it was all his fault and he knows it. No one in the Spider Society could ever understand how it feels. An entire universe of Vincent lives gone because of him. The weight of responsibility and self-loathing this man is shouldering. This is exactly why he was 10,000% protecting on Miles too. This is your fault, bro. Yeah, Miles may have set off a bit of a chain reaction, but oh my God, it's so much projecting his own hurt. It's insane. A kid that doesn't know what he's doing. Stop. That's what gives Miguel so much flavor. Like not only is he that, but he has so much angst. He is the entire package. Damn, this pairing is actually pretty popular. Oof. I deserve an award for all the willpower I'm exerting right now. Like I can barely talk at this point. My God. Thinking of happy Miguel right now. Everybody knows that. Like, you go to any place, you can't. Uh. <laughs> How many times will I have to see this man tied up? If I had a nickel every time Miguel O'Hara was tied up, I'd have a lot of nickels. Holy hell. Why is the art for him so good? I cannot handle it. I'm in love with this Dorito. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> It's me for real, for real. <laughs> oh, that symbolism. <sighs> I am weak. <laughs> Look at me getting disheveled all over the sky. Oh, let go, let go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Wow, I'm normal insane, sure. Waifu beamed your old man. <laughs> He's very pretty like this, to be fair. The Spider-Verse crew knew what they were doing. Miguel's model's ready for review. Okay, let's have a look. <laughs> 3D modeler. Look, I totally understand I do and I'm on board with it, but you gotta tone it down just a bit. Not too much though, <laughs> damn. Thank you for doing the Lord's work. Yet again, everybody say thank you to the 3D modelers that worked on this movie. <laughs> mm. What a comment section does to mother I have a tummy ache from all the critiques and I'm being a great girl about it. Quick edit, people really like him, huh? It's just a little bit. Miguel O'Hara got me giggling, blushing, curling my toe. <laughs> Morning coffee. Can I join your elite crew of spider people, Miguel? Just watched Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. I thought Hopi was hot, but excuse me, Mr. Miguel was so juicy. Jesus Christ. I'm not complaining, but holy hell. And that's more corrupt Miguel at a Sunday That is so funny. I'm gonna be honest, I was not immune to Miguel O'Hara from the Spider-Verse at all. I was white knuckling that in the theater, just like everyone else. This is a fun style. I like the colors. Million Knives, what are you doing here? You can't run away from me. Who says I am, buddy? The fact that they made Miguel be so large is so funny because he's so, so pathetic. Imagine being that big and have an anarchist teenager wail like a doom siren every time you time a child to I want them to be besties in my dumb mind. They are, they are. Miguel discovers AO3. Yeah, accurate. <laughs> He's grounded. What do you mean canon events are made up? <laughs> ah, uh, some Miguel X Femme reader. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> POV, you're just a little anomaly. Nuh uh. <laughs> oh, wow. Lila wasn't kidding about how you weird you drink. Oh. <laughs> Warm. Oh, there's more. There's more. Oh. 
Oh, 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 oh. So there's this set of pixel. <laughs> We call this a traumatic experience, not a bruh moment, not sag, and definitely not oof lamao. <laughs> Family did no, no, I got to do him dirty like that. Surrounded by incompetence, you're the only one who has not tested my ire. They are canon, let them be canon. Miguel Burger, I didn't even see that. I, <laughs> wow, wow. Whoa, wow. <laughs> so much YN, ex Miguel on Tumblr. I need him so badly, it's not even a joke anymore. My moral compass leaving my body when a villain is sexy. Oscar Isaac, aww. Holy <laughs> sh there's over 7,000 fix for Spider-Verse. Then looking into the relationships, yep, nope, the number one is Miguel O'Hara, ex-reader, followed by Miles and Gwen, and then Hopi and Miles, and then Miguel and Peter, the spider daddies, mostly teen. <laughs> Nearly half the Miguel ex-reader fix are explicit, and then explicit and mature make up over half. Basically, Miguel O'Hara porn because that man is too damn fine, he's dominant and a bit of an asshole, but it's worth it, enjoy. Miguel had cannons, he's so big. Baby, baby, and the tags are so funny. <laughs> there is certainly a lot happening here. Miguel has a big. <laughs> Miguel O'Hara has issues. Blood kink, Jesus. Religious imagery and symbolism. Now we're talking with the Catholic guilt. Soft Miguel. I know people keep talking about how they want Miguel to rail them, but you know what I want to see? I want to see Miguel getting railed. Slow burn, slow, slow. It's. Glacial. <laughs> Male wife Miguel O'Hara. That's my favorite tag so far. Blood drinking. <laughs> oh my god, this is actually no, this is my favorite. Eggs? Oh no. Oh no, 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 oh no. I can't even say some of these tags. Well, if you're curious, look at the AO3 section yourself. Yeah, for the most part, there's a lot of smut, but there's also a lot of angst, no happy ending, hurt, no comfort, a potent mixture of sadness and smut. He was pretty skinny in the first one. It was before the trauma hit. <laughs> no, the trauma made him bigger, but at what cost? I wanna ride. We don't need oxygen anymore, Edward. We only need BTS. He has no rules, no boundaries. He doesn't flinch at torture, human trafficking, or genocide. Yes. He's not loyal to a flag or a country. I wanna ride. <laughs> the number of likes these edits have, y'all are down bad. See, it's the same shots over and over and over again because people are looking with the trailer stuff, but it still looks really good, no matter what song is being used. Okay, <laughs> yeah, my algorithm is f***ed after this video. When it comes to a smackback, I can't lie. I wanna ride. <laughs> my husband, I'm happy, I'm happy to see my husband. <laughs> Oh my god! You mean I'm cheeked up in The Sims too? Not Wicked Whims. No. no. Why are all the comments about Wicked Whims? Y'all are nasty. You did, Gwen. And you... I was gonna try ignoring you. I just can't. I can't even. Girl, I'm trying to loosen you. Have an appetite, goose and juice. Baby, tell me what it's gonna be. Oh, it just keeps getting better. <laughs> me when he chases me because he actually messed up with the cannon. Okay, that's, <laughs> we really gotta call it now. Well, thank you very much for going on this delightfully thirsty journey with me. <laughs> are you as down bad for Miguel as the rest of the internet is? Do you think Miguel deserves the hype? Or are you more like Tumblr and are like, I think the spot is better. And how many times have you been jump scared by Miguel's nether regions on your For You page or timeline? Spider-Verse in general is getting a lot more content because yeah, there's a lot going down for the fandom for that. <laughs> Thanks again, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs> If 
someone hasn't already, please make a boob mouse pad of Miguel. Give me a number. I will match it.